Hey guys, it's me, Rogero, and today I am gonna try something out, something new. Well, maybe not so much new, but it's new to me. And uh, I like beer, so I like, you know, I like the taste of it. I like the, you know, different, different types of beers, like, you know, stouts, IPAs, you know, stuff like that. Um, ciders, no, no, no hard ciders for me, though. Um, earlier today, during my day job at, you know, I work at Costco, uh, and a member came up with, the, you know, came into my line with this, uh, specialty, uh, seasonal holiday beer that I, uh, thought I might like to try. And one of my favorite breweries, you know, most of all, is Rogue Brewery. They are, you know, they're the guys that's located up in, down in Newport, Oregon. I've been to their brewery. I've been to their, you know, restaurants. And, God, they got some really good stuff. I mean, especially the, you know, the specialty uh, beers. So, I've had, you know, I love them. They got good stuff. Um, this year, they got a 2020 holiday seasonal beer called Santa's Private Reserve and it's Peppermint Bark Milk Stout. I did not even know that was a thing. I didn't even realize it. I mean, I don't even know what a milk stout is. I haven't had a chance to even look it up. I just bought this thing. Got it at Costco. It's like 10 bucks for this bottle. Um, I'm just like, wow, this looks pretty good. I'm a huge fan of Rogue. You know, they're my favorite. The name on my YouTube channel is purely coincidental. <laughs> um, but yeah, I mean, the, dude, the artwork on this thing is just really good. I like it. You know, this little rogue. Um, and I'm using my, uh, my my most favorite rogue glass that I got from the restaurant. For, that was like seven bucks right there. So we're just gonna dive right in. I'm gonna taste it, see how I like, you know, see if I like it. I'm pretty sure I will. There goes my cap. Um, ooh, wow, this is this really this this smells good, dude. All right, so I'm just gonna do a little pour. I did promise my mother-in-law to try it. Ooh, wow. Look at that. I'm just gonna do half the glass here, but yeah, look at that. Nice little, you know. Oh, dude. Yeah, you could uh, you could smell the peppermint in there. I'm not sure where the milk is coming from. There's, I mean, eh. well, I'm just gonna swig it down. Oh wow, that's really good. Wow, you got that sweet chocolate taste. You can really taste the peppermint in there. Oh man, you get it's like a liquefied pe chocolate peppermint bark, you know, with alcohol. Uh, wow. Oh. Yeah, it's really good. Yeah. I mean, it's not really bitter either. Or it's not all that bitter. You can still taste a little bit of bitterness, but it's not that bad. Um, I know I know a lot of stouts would, are, you know, like super high on the, you know, bitterness. But, yeah, you know, sweet, chocolatey. You could def definitely taste the peppermint in there. I would totally rec dude if you guys if you guys want to give this a shot and go to like one of your supermarkets or go buy a bottle of this because this is really good especially during the holidays which is nice and you can even pair it with some stuff uh, on the uh, bottom here 
just says pair it with deviled eggs, pork roast, and sugar cookies. I think for me personally, this would be more of a like kind of like a dessert thing, you know, a bit of a dessert beer, more of a than a dinner beer. But yeah, I like it. It's really good. I would totally recommend this. Yeah, it's really good. Tastes really good, you know, chilled, obviously, you know, you, I mean, <laughs> who wants to drink warm beer? So, uh, that's pretty much all I got right now. That's, yeah, I mean, wow. I'm going to, you know, save, uh, save most of this for my mother-in-law who wants to try this out. Oh, yeah, that's really good. I mean... Yeah, don't take my word for it, but go out there, give it a shot. If you like it, that's great. If not, then, you know, whatever. It's all good. And don't forget to, you know, subscribe to my channel. And if there's anything else you want me to try out, you know, whether it's a food or a drink or, you know, something within reason, uh, comment below. Um... Yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm not a professional reviewer, but, you know, I just like to, you know, try something out and just give my take on it, which, you know, I've already done. Um, I, I hope the guys at Rogue, you know, see this video as well. You know, I'll be sure I'm going to try and tag them on, the, you know, this video. And, you know, hey. Um, you know, I love their stuff. You know, they're, they're like my favorite guys. So... I would always recommend Rogue. I've recommended Rogue to like every, to a lot of people. I mean, I do like other you know other breweries too. You know, especially the ones in my local area. But you know, I think my all-time favorite is Rogue beer. So anyway, um, that's all I got for today, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye bye.